Hello again. In previous episodes, we explored the basics of cryptocurrencies and blockchain. You already know that blockchain is a revolutionary way to store and share information. Now it's time to dig deeper, to understand the core structure of blockchain and how it keeps everything running smoothly and securely. Let's start with the building blocks, literally, of the blockchain. The blocks themselves. A blockchain is made up of countless blocks, and each block holds a batch of information, mainly transactions. Think of each block like a page in a financial ledger where new transactions are recorded permanently. But a block isn't just a simple list. It contains several important elements that make blockchain powerful and secure. Key elements inside each block. List of transactions. Every transfer of cryptocurrency. Every smart contract action. Every token creation. They're all recorded here. Timestamp. When exactly did these transactions happen? The timestamp records the date and time, adding a clear sequence to the history. Previous blocks hash. Each block knows the fingerprint of the block before it. Nonce. A special number used during mining to find a valid hash. More on this later. How blocks connect. Blocks are connected chronologically. Each new block is linked to the one before it by carrying its hash. This is why it's called a chain. A secure, unbreakable sequence of blocks stretching back to the very beginning. Example. Imagine you send one Bitcoin to your friend. That transaction, along with many others happening around the same time, is bundled into a new block. After validation by the network, that block is locked in place, permanently added to the blockchain. What is a hash, and what is its role? Now let's talk about something very important, the hash. A hash is a unique digital signature created from the information inside a block. You can think of it like a fingerprint. No two hashes are the same unless the blocks are identical. Key points about hashes. Hashes are generated using cryptographic algorithms like SHA-256, designed to be fast, secure, and one-way. Even the slightest change, a single letter, a single digit, will completely change the hash. The hash of each block is stored inside the next block, creating a tightly linked chain. Why is this important? If someone tries to tamper with a transaction in an old block, the hash will change. And because every subsequent block depends on the previous hash, the tampering becomes instantly visible to the entire network. Example. Imagine you changed one character in a transaction recorded weeks ago. Suddenly the hash of that block would change, and the next block's reference to it would no longer match. It's like pulling one thread and unraveling an entire sweater. What is a distributed ledger? Now, let's zoom out even further. Blockchain isn't just a database locked away on one computer. It's a distributed ledger spread across thousands of devices around the world. Key features of the distributed ledger. Every node, computer, in the network holds a complete copy of the blockchain. New transactions must be validated and agreed upon by the majority before being added. Once added, the information is almost impossible to change because so many independent copies exist. Why is this powerful? There's no single point of failure. No central server to hack. No administrator to bribe. Security is built into the very structure of the network itself. Simple summary. Block, a package that contains grouped transactions. Hash, a unique secure digital fingerprint for each block. Ledger, a public shared record of all transactions that everyone in the network keeps. Why is this structure important? These three elements, block, hash, and ledger, work together to create a system that is, one, secure, two, transparent, three, immutable. Because of this structure, we can trust blockchain transactions without needing a middleman like a bank, government, or other third party. 
It's a true peer-to-peer -peer revolution. Now you know that blockchain isn't just some complicated tech buzzword. It's a smart, secure, and highly engineered system. Built on three key pillars, block, hash, and ledger. This structure forms the foundation of cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin and Ethereum, smart contracts, decentralized finance, DeFi, NFTs, and so much more. If you're curious to see how different blockchain networks, like Bitcoin, Ethereum, and Solana, implement these ideas differently, be sure to follow our next episodes. And remember, we're here to explore the world of crypto together, step by step. So don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to stay updated. See you in the next episode.